Hello everybody, this is Mark, T-Dog. I'll show you how to fix something that's been happening on these F7 flight controllers. So what happens is, for whatever reason, you're not getting all the tones, and you plug it in, and you don't have any drives. Bummer. So, this is what you do. You plug your flight controller in. Now, mine has drives, as you can see here. So, what we're going to do is we're going to delete them. But it would have helped. This way it gives you a good example of what it looks like. Okay, so you plug it in, and this is what your drive looks like. So, come down here, and you type in disk. Disk. And this one, right here. It's I think it's disk management is the, is the name of it. And then you're going to see... Let's go down here, and there it is. There's your drive, 124 megabytes fat. And then you're going to right-click on that, delete volume. Yep. And it's going to delete it. Okay, close that out. Now you're going to unplug your flight controller. And then you're going to plug your flight controller back in. You're going to wait a couple seconds. And then the file explorer will pop back up. What it did is it just reformatted. And look, it's got all of your folders again. So then what you do is you go to flight1.com. Go to downloads, Falco firmware. Pick your version, whatever one you want. I don't know which one this one is. I think we'll do heads up lightning. And then you're going to go to the firmware folder. See so there's nothing in there. You're going to hit save. Now I'll write it right to the firmware folder. Uh, the logos, I don't believe, are up yet anywhere. Uh, hopefully that will be coming. There it is. Okay, download it. So now that's there. Now you won't have the startup info or image. This is where it would go. Uh, once those are available, uh, I'll li link to it. And then you c I got my own little one I made for my two dog. So I'll put that back in here. I'm going to close this. Belco configurator. Uh, there. All right, it just took a couple of tries to restart it, and then it works. Go here, and plug it back in, and now everything is right where I need it to be, and you're done. Hope that helps.